Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Mach Systems, now Rheinmetall, has developed the Wiesel 2 family of airportable armored vehicles, which are in active service with the German army in various configurations. Among them is a version equipped as a self-propelled 120mm mortar. The initial prototype of this mortar carrier was finalized in 1997, with a subsequent contract awarded by the German Ministry of Defense to Rheinmetall in 2002 for the supply of two mortar carriers for trials and evaluation. These units were delivered in 2004 and underwent testing in the USA for hot weather trials and in Sweden for cold weather trials in 2005. Following successful testing, the German Ministry of Defense granted a production contract for eight units in 2009, with delivery completed by 2011. By 2015, the German army had ordered a total of 20 of these self-propelled mortars, designated as Leister Panzer Morser 120mm or Le PZ Misses 120mm. This mortar carrier has reportedly seen action in Afghanistan but has not been exported, likely due to limited demand from other countries for such specialized airportable vehicles. The artillery system is equipped with a 120mm mortar featuring an automatic gun laying system. Loading of the mortar is manual, with the mortar being lowered to a horizontal position for loading before automatically returning to its firing position. The Le PZ Misses is capable of firing standard 120mm mortar ammunition, including high explosive, smoke, and illumination rounds, as well as guided ammunition like the Strix Smart rounds. Its maximum firing range is up to 6,000 meters, with a total of 27 rounds carried on board, including 25 standard rounds and 2 guided rounds. The maximum rate of fire is 6 rounds per minute, sustainable for 3 minutes. For self-defense, the mortar carrier is equipped with a roof-mounted 7.62mm machine gun. It features an advanced fire control system that enables autonomous fire missions. The vehicle's hull is constructed of welded steel, providing limited protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. It is equipped with an NVC protection system, ensuring crew safety during loading operations. Stabilizing jacks at the rear are deployed before firing, facilitating quick setup. The Le PZ misses 120mm can be brought into action within 60 seconds of traveling and can briefly relocate to evade counter-battery fire. With a crew of three comprising a commander, loader, and driver, the vehicle shares its chassis with the Wiesel 2, powered by a Volkswagen 1.9-liter turbocharged diesel engine generating 109 horsepower coupled with a ZF automatic transmission. Engine and transmission replacement can be carried out in the field within 15 minutes. Its low weight, tracked configuration, and low ground pressure afforded excellent cross-country mobility, with the capability to traverse water obstacles with the addition of a flotation kit. The Wiesel 2 mortar carrier is fully airportable internally by a CH-53 helicopter and can also be transported under slung. Notably, the CH-53G helicopter is widely utilized by the German army, facilitating rapid deployment of the mortar carrier. Additionally, it can be airlifted by military transport aircraft. A typical German army unit equipped with a Le PZ misses 120mm comprises two mortar platoons, each consisting of four mortar carriers, along with a command post vehicle based on the Mungo 4x4 airborne armored vehicle and a fire control center. Target information is provided by a forward observation officer, and if necessary, each mortar carrier can operate autonomously. That's all for now, see you later.